YouTube, Patrick here. Welcome back to my channel, where we discuss uh, model railroad related things. Uh, today we're going to talk about a little bit of lighting for uh, one of my buildings, and how I'm going to make that work. If this is your first time to the channel, I want to thank you for coming. Make sure you go down below, and hit subscribe, and hit the little bell. It'll notify you every time I upload a new video. Other than that, let's get to it. Flip the camera around and we'll get set up. So this is my maintenance facility off of the layout, giving it some lighting. Um, got three LEDs. They are hooked up. And I'll run a wire down each side. I'll go underneath the layout and the resistor will be underneath. Um, I actually want to find some straight rod instead of just a wire I have. But this is more a um, demonstration of what I want, not necessarily a final product. It's more of a prototype. Uh, I may actually do more LEDs. I haven't decided yet. But I kind of wanted to go for uh, railings across the top of the facility. Like you'd find out in a, a real facility, it should light up pretty good. So uh, I will flip it over, hook it up, we'll get a little bit of lighting going. So this actually gives me the amount of light that I want. You actually can't even see the lights unless you climb up in there. I do have to put some tape or something above them so it does not shine through but I don't get a ton of bleed through anywhere else so I think this is going to be a success I'm actually kind of liking it so that's pretty much it for this project uh, or at least this version of it I'm gonna tinker with a little, little more but I wanted to um, so like I said, I'll have one wire going down to this corner of the building underneath the layout. Another wire from that corner going underneath the layout. Uh, I'm going to have a DC transformer uh, hooked up for all my lighting. And I'm going to slowly light each building um, so I can use it at night. And kind of have a nighttime look for it. Um, but I just use regular... LEDs. I actually used three millimeter LEDs just because I wanted a little smaller. Um, it is a, I think, an 1800 ohm resistor. Uh, you always want a resistor in with your uh, LED lights. Um, but yeah, that's it. I will, uh, next layout update, I will have this down on the layout and uh, lit up so I can show you. Yeah, like I said, uh, quick short video. Sorry it's not very detailed. Uh, there's not a ton to show unless you want to see me solder a couple of LEDs to some wire. I didn't think you really wanted to see that, so I skipped it. Like I said, I will show you guys the building down on the layout in my next layout update. Um, been busy with work um, between now and Memorial Day is pretty much my busiest time of year so getting down to the layout is going to uh, take a little effort so videos are going to slow down a little bit but I'm going to still try and get one video out a week um, this video is coming out today coming up to a mm, couple days uh, we're going to have a part one of my control panel. Uh, I actually got my control panel box. Um, I've been tinkering with how I want the layout to look. Um, and I've got most of the parts I need to do it. So we're going to get started on that. See you guys next time.